One woman is dead, another fighting for her life after a terrible crash Friday night near the White House. News 4 has learned the driver, now charged, 35-year-old Spiro Stefalados, is the man seen wearing a blue hoodie robbing a gas station in the White Oak area of Silver Spring in 2020. Maryland court records show that in 2021, he was sentenced to three years in prison, but the term was suspended and he was put on probation instead. Of course, Jackie Benson has new details on Friday night's crash, including why he refused to stop for police. Court documents reveal U.S. Secret Service Uniform Division officers patrolling on mountain bikes initially stopped the driver of the 2016 Buick LeSabre. That driver, 35-year-old Spiro Stafilatos, is accused of causing the horrific crash Friday night that leaves one female pedestrian dead and another critically injured. According to court documents, officers noticed the Buick's front license plate was missing and the Maryland hard tag on the rear had no sticker. That plate was later discovered to be registered to a 2016 Chevrolet. The documents accuse Stefilatos of putting his car in gear, driving away from the officers, running a red light on New York Avenue at 14th Street Northwest, where he hit another car entering the intersection on a green light. Police say the impact caused Stefilatos' car to spin around with great force and hit two women who were in the crosswalk. In the immediate aftermath, a witness saw Stefilatos putting something in his mouth, and officers noticed that a white powdery substance was observed. The court documents say Stafilatos later told officers, quote, I take five different meds from police trying to kill me back. Stafilatos is currently charged with murder two, aggravated assault, no permit, and misuse of tags. Jackie Benson, News 4.